Well, here it is. This is my newest acquiry. It's a 1997 Honda Accord. It's obviously rolled over. The lady that owned it before me actually worked for her at both stores, um, the Felton Safeway and the Scotts Valley Safeway. And she actually went for the windshield because she wasn't wearing her seatbelt. So, anyways, the roof is pretty mangled. Um, I think it has frame damage underneath. I thought I could save it by looking at the pictures, but it's just too far gone. So, I got it because it has good tires and they're the same size that my Subaru needs. And the back ones are virtually new, they're only a few months old, so... And it has a brand new battery. Where's the key? Uh, send the mission? No. There it is. It is actually still registered until October. It looks good from the back. If anyone needed a back clip, I mean, not this side, but this side. Okay, from like here on. You know, he's going to save most of the parts from it and save it for future cars. I want the engine. The engine only has, look at this, hundred and fifty thousand miles, and it has zero blow by. That's the optional flow through windshield, in case your air conditioning that doesn't work. And the air conditioning does work, shocking enough. This side is much, much worse. All the way through on that side. The transmission shifts like brand new. You can't even feel it to shifts. Anyways, let me start it up. I hooked the battery. I don't even know why I unhooked it, but... This window's broken. I tried to roll it up. I was like, why don't, don't I even hear the motor? And then I saw... Anyways, there's not a whole lot to save on this car, but I am going to put the back seat. Sometimes this door handle works for people really hard, but it always works on the inside. Let's lift out both doors in the back. I'm going to make a couch out of this seat because it's comfortable, it's leather, so. And I'll probably do something with that passenger seat, but the driver's seat's too far gone. It's going to go to the crusher. Um, when I chopped the car up and sent it off. Yeah, but Come on, focus. <laughs> it even broke the aluminum valve cover. 
but and they even broke the oil cap. This is the oil cap off. I think one of my Jeeps. It's either my 95 Jeep Cherokee or my 99 Wrangler, but but it has zero blow by. So I'm gonna do a compression test. The compression is good, really good. I'm gonna save the motor and transmission and all that, and use it for something else in the future. Because I plan to get one of these cars eventually. Anyway, that's about it. Until we meet again.